Hey guys, my name is Ashley Waters, um, and today I'm going to be reading Moon Game by Frank Ash. The book's a bit tatty, but it's because I read it so much to my kids and they really love it, so you should too. So let's get started. One day, Little Bird showed Bear a new game, Hide and Seek. First, he told Bear to hide and counted to ten. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Then he went looking for Bear. I found you, chirped Little Bird when he found Bear hiding behind some bushes. Now it's your turn to find me. All day long until the sun went down, Bear and Little Bird played their new game. That night when Bear was all alone, he looked up in the sky and said to the moon, let's play hide and seek. First I'll hide and you find me. Then Bear ran as fast as he could until he came to an old hollow tree. Climbing inside, he ducked down so the moon couldn't see him. Bear waited for a while, then he poked his head up. When he did, the moon was right there, looking down at him. Okay, said Bear, you found me. Now it's your turn to hide. Closing his eyes, Bear began to count, just as Little Bird had shown him. At that moment, a gentle breeze slowly hid the moon behind a big cloud. When Bear finished counting, he set out to find the moon. First, he thought he found the moon hiding behind some rocks. Then he thought he found the moon hiding in someone's house. When Bear thought he found the moon hiding in a tree, he shook the tree and cried, I found you, moon! But Bear was mistaken. All he'd found was a big balloon. Then Little Bird came by to visit. Will you help me find the moon? asked Bear. Sure, I'll help, chirped Little Bird. Bear and Little Bird looked and looked, but they couldn't find the moon. So they went to the forest to ask for help. I think the moon is lost, explained Bear. Can you help me find him? Don't worry, we'll help, replied the animals in the forest. Together they searched and searched, but they couldn't find the moon. At last, Bear sat down and sighed. The moon is lost, and it's all my fault. Then Bear got an idea. He jumped up and cried. Okay, Moon, I give up. You win. Just then, the breeze began to blow again, and the Moon came out of his hiding place. Look, chirped Little Bird. The Moon wasn't lost. He was just hiding behind that big cloud. Bear was so happy, he danced and danced. Then everyone played hide and seek. Moon game. Thank you guys for listening and watching. Um, like I said, you were watching Save, Save With Stories, um, which is helping save the children, raise money for family and children all around the world who have been hit the hardest by the coronavirus. So it's really important that you follow the guidelines after this film um, on how to donate. Really important if you can. Thank you very much for watching. Take care.